Hello and welcome back for another video. In today's video, we're going to talk about the equipment which can be very helpful for kyphosis patients. This video is sponsored by Kyphonic. Nonetheless, stick around and I will show you what it is. For those who are new, my name is Bakn again. I'm an MRI radiographer. So in my channel, I'm covering things from basic to advanced MRI topics, tutorials just like this one. If you haven't subscribed yet, considering doing so. Pearl Day, there's no real tool for helping those patients to get on the table, you know, to tilt and everything. So what we usually do is that we remove the tabletop. Now the head coil is able to tilt whenever you're doing new imaging. But you know, whenever you're tilting too much, it will be very difficult to get on the anterior part because it will touch the chest. However, you can remove the anterior part and then you can use the small flex or large flex to cover the front part of the head. Doing so, it's also possible, but you need at least two or three radiographers for being able to lift up the patient, to get some pillow down below, to get the right angulation so the patient will slide down the head coil. It can be very dangerous for your back. So the first time I saw Kaifu lift, it's like, yeah, it's a tool which is needed for those kind of patients. So you can work alone. You don't need two or three radiographers. So let's check out their webpage kyphonlift.com and then we go into the product and let's check it out. There's a video here which showing you how you can do it. As you see, there's only one radiographer here. There's a part where you can put it behind of the patient and there's a pump right here. So the patient's lying on this table. You can see an example here, right here. It's a kyphosis patient. It's great, you don't need two or three radiographers. You don't need to remove the, 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 the back of the table, the spine coil, and you're able to, to pump it like that. So the patient will slide down the head coil. And the best part is that you're able to use the same settings every time for this patient. And it's not only for MM scanner, you can also use this for multimodality, CT, X-ray, whatever. So it's a nice tool which is, I mean, needed in your department. For more information, they will be available at the upcoming RSNA. So stop by and uh, check it out if you got time. Well, that's it guys. If you like this video, do not forget to put the like button, hit the subscribe, hit the notification bell so you get a ding ding whenever new videos from me are coming up. Until next time, take care and I'll catch up with you in my next video. Bye bye.